everyone and welcome back to my channel. So in today's video I have a very exciting video. I have teamed up with the amazing brand Technic Cosmetics once again. If you guys are regular watchers on my channel then you know that Technic and I have like a really good bond. Uh, Technic has a really special soft spot in my heart. I love their products. They're super amazing. They're a UK brand. They're cruelty free. Like, what more could you want? So I have the, had the opportunity to work with Technic a few times and I'm so grateful and thankful for every time that they reach out for me to make videos for them. But yeah, I love the brand regardless. I have bought a lot of their stuff on my own, but I also do get sent stuff from the brand as well. So if you want to see the brand new products that has just dropped, which let me tell you, Technic just seems to keep getting better and better and better and better as they go on, as in hot trending products, amazing quality products. I'm just in love. So thank you Technic for helping me make this video once again for you guys. And I hope you guys enjoy. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up. Now, if you guys are seeing my face, I know it's been a very long time. I have had a pretty rough month, hence why I haven't been on YouTube. I don't want to blab too much on about it on my beauty channel. So if you want to go see the full update as to what has been going on in the past month, then I'll have my vlog slash where I've been kind of update video down below so you can go watch it. But if you're not interested, that is totally fine. You're probably here for the Technic video. So I hope you guys do enjoy the Technic video, but yeah, let's just get onto the video. Okay, so I'm going to start off with their new foundation sticks, which I'll give you guys a close-up of and show you these awesome new foundation sticks they came out with. They sent me three shades. So I got sand, which is like my foundation color. And then I have cafe latte, which is a lighter color, which I'm gonna use under my eyes. And then I have butterscotch, which is like a bronzy um, contour color. It's probably not contour, it's more bronze, but they do have eight shades of these in total. I have three. The shade range is really good. It goes up to really dark. I might even get a darker, more cooler tone one if they have one for cream contouring. But other than that, I have tried these once. <clears throat> I tried all of this stuff once that I'm going to show you guys just because I wanted to have sort of like a brief idea of what I was showing you before I did show you. So my shade for foundation is sand. It's probably not the best shade, but it's not horrible, like if I just give you guys a close-up. <clears throat> so that is sand there, and this is number 13. So I'm just gonna go ahead and apply the rest of the foundation stick to my face. I would say it's not extremely creamy, but it's not overly hard and I have to tug to get any pigmentation. I'm just going to take the Real Techniques Expert Face Brush to buff this out. So I'm going to push into the skin and then sort of do circular motions as well. So these do blend pretty nicely I would say. I'll show you guys half of my face once I've blended it all in. So here is basically half of my face already blended in. It really hasn't taken much time at all. So as you can see, I've still got the foundation on this side and then this side is pretty much blended all in. Now, I wouldn't say it's full, full coverage, but it does give a really nice natural coverage and it's obviously really good if you are on the go and need something quick. Like if you have skin like me that's not that troubled, then it's definitely something that will work well for you because yeah, you can work them in really quickly and it doesn't take that long at all. So here's how my skin is looking after just one layer of the foundation, you can still see a bit of this redness peeking through and like a redness on my nose, but it's not too bad. Like looking at it in natural light, 
lighting in real life like it just looks like skin that's what I absolutely love about these foundations they're definitely not 110% full coverage but if you like a natural finish and something that looks like your skin but obviously a little bit better a little bit tweaked it has gotten most of the redness off on my cheeks but yeah if you're someone that loves a natural coverage then you'll definitely love this foundation stick and these retail for like five bucks or under I think I saw the listing on eBay Australian dollars that they were listed at about $4.20 so super super bargain so I'm gonna go and layer up a little bit more where I feel like I need it so probably just a bit on my cheeks and that's the good thing about these sticks is you can layer them without them getting too too cakey in terms of finish I would say that it dries down pretty matte like my face doesn't feel super sticky it's not like completely matte but that could be because I've moisturized beforehand or whatnot but I definitely have to set it regardless just because I do have oily skin but if you are someone who's dry then you probably like the finish of it on its own hopefully so yeah let's move on I'm gonna do some cream contouring and highlighting so I'm gonna go in with the contouring first this one is in the shade number six butterscotch sorry it's more like bronzing this is more like a bronzer shade so I'm just gonna do it where I would bronze Light bit under my chin. So just in these sort of regions and then I'm just going to go in with a flat kabuki block brush and blend it out. Again they blend out seamlessly. And then for the lighter shade to act as concealer slash highlight points, this is the shade 10 Cafe Latte. So I'm just going to hit under my eyes with that, sort of brighten up this area. Go under that contour line, or bronzer line I should say, down the center of my nose. I'm kind of just above my eyebrows a bit. So that is how I use these foundation sticks. I'm gonna go off, finish the rest of my face, come back, and then show you guys the other new products. I didn't get sent products for a full face, but I do have other elements of my face that I can share with you guys with their new products. So I will see you guys in a second. Next product I wanna share with you guys today is the new Technic Metallics eyeshadow creams. These are stunning. Um, I'm obsessed with the whole eyeshadow cream trend at the moment. I feel like a lot of people are doing it and Technic nailed it with theirs. So that one there is in the shade Champagne for Everybody, which is just so, so stunning. And then the other shade I have is called Taupe B, which is this taupey bronzy type of shade here, which I will swatch next to it, which is that color there. As you can see, when they hit the light, they are super, super, super reflective. So I'm obsessed, like so, so good. So I'm just gonna zoom you guys in and I'm gonna apply that. So I'm gonna take the champagne one 
and just pop it all over my lid and I just like to take it on a brush and then sort of work it Okay, so the lucky last thing I want to share with you guys today is probably the most exciting, especially if you're a highlighter lover like myself. This is the new Color Fix highlighter palette and it just says highly pigmented, blendable, baked and pressed powders for a natural glowing finish. So you get eight powders and it just looks like there are others kind of Color Fix palettes. If you're familiar with them, these are so, so pigmented and amazing like if I just give you guys an example they're so good I'm definitely going to show you swatches in a second but let's just put these on my face so my three colors that I've sort of been drawn to is this one this one and this yellow one I kind of just mix them all together and then just go to town with highlight on my face like look at that glow you guys these are stunning. Oh, I'm just, I'm obsessed. So you get eight highlighters, a range of different colors. As you guys can see, this palette is like five or six dollars Australian. Like it is, it's a joke. Look at that glow. Like. They meant business when they made this palette. And it is definitely speaking for itself. So I'm going to show you guys swatches of these, but this is a product you definitely need to get your hands on if you are a highlighter junkie like myself. So that you guys is going to wrap up my video testing some of the brand new Technic products. Make sure you go check the links down below. I'll have all their social media where you can buy it, all the information that you need to know down below. Also, don't forget to follow me on social media if you want to keep up to date with my posts, new makeup products, all of that sort of stuff. I love you guys so much and thank you for tuning in to another one of my videos and sticking around. I'm all about affordable, great quality makeup at a low price. So I love you guys so much and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye you guys.